Behold, the brilliant silence of space. Domain of the Imperial Battle Group. Mighty war machines built for the purpose of keeping the peace. These impressive ships are called home to a crew of thousands and a complement of divisions of soldiers supported by an arsenal of other vehicles and fighter craft. However, these vessels serve as more than just mobile weapons platforms. The presence of their patrols in the shipping lanes provides security by projecting the order of Imperial authority. This is the story of the Revenge-class heavy carrier, Relentless. Her crew will be taking the Relentless on her 50th tour, enforcing peace and restoring order to the hundreds of star systems in this sector of the galaxy. the space in which it patrols and is the greatest armada the galaxy has ever seen assembled under one flag. The capital ships of the Imperial Naval Fleet form the backbone of the Empire. By themselves, these fighting machines offer the most powerful and awe-inspiring image of military strength. What a battle group such as this represents is the vision of the Empire's virtually limitless power. Attention. But it is the ship's crew who are its life's blood, without which nothing would be possible. Its advanced navigational systems permit rapid hyperspace jumps at a moment's notice. That puts this carrier battle group in the class of the Imperial Fleet's most important and powerful resources. jurisdiction of the Imperial fleet and the realm of the Empire, there exists an almost limitless diversity of inhabited worlds. For those who serve among the Imperial armed forces, this means that every single life form, on every single world, in every system, is under our protection. Here, Social unrest and criminal enterprises undermined imperial order. Besieged by militant groups, the garrison requires a constant supply of fresh troops and equipment. It would be impossible to station troops in every system within the Empire, but its carrier battle groups give the Empire the ability to deploy anywhere it wishes on short notice. Shuttle 2249 Echo, you are cleared to depart straight out. Remain out of below tops until clear of the relentless. 2249er Echo, below top, still clear. 2249er Echo, contact Davenport Approach at 1 or 249er. Tell them you've got traffic. Heavy hunting. Going to approach, 2249er Echo. We'll see you on the other side. State of the art weapon systems and technology may be the instruments for initiating the peace process, but it is the ground forces that play an essential role in keeping it. Approach shuttle 2249 Echo, leaving relentless inbound with the numbers. 2249 Echo, atmosphere approach Delta, plan on entering visual approach Alpha. Welcome to Davenport Gateway. 
Increasingly, Imperial troops are required to act as peace officers in systems where local law enforcement agencies are not adequate to control the general populace. By assuming this responsibility, the Empire's influence is expanded. If it was not for the strong Imperial presence in this sector, precious civilian lives would be lost. It is in this world that the Imperial soldier must keep a level head, a steady hand, and a watchful eye. Command to Team 8257, come in. 8257 Rail Runner, go ahead. Command 8257, it's your last day out, right? You want an easy one? Negative, just give us whatever you got. Copy that. Checking the monitors. There's a prison transport in your section right now. They've got it under control. Proceed to Sector 5, copy. Roger that, Command 8257 out. In large crowds like this, trouble can come from anywhere at any time. You don't know what to expect from these things. The last hours on the job will be the worst. Tired and ready for a break, sloppiness loses lives. That's why we must take on our last mission just like any other. It is an easy restoring order in this place. Being an Imperial trooper means we're in charge out here. This uniform and the Empire's reputation commands respect. Hey, look, they're hanging the decorations for the FNCs. I don't remember banners when we were freaking new guys. The banners are on out to reinforce morale and welcome new replacement troops to the garrison. Since this is the last day of our tour, we'll be shipped out on the next rotation for other duties and other commands. Putting on a good show will help ease public tension and add to the air of support the new arrival. They'll learn how things really are soon enough. Yeah, most of squad's gone. I'll be happy enough just to get back on a ship, peeling off this armor, and taking a hot shower. Copy that. Command, Century Patrol 735, Grid 226, sublevel R. Century Patrol Command, go ahead, 735. Command, we're checking on report of possible disturbance. Sublevel 2134. Request support team, over. 735 command, copy that request. We see it, sub 21. Support team 8257 standing by. Ew. Oh, didn't need to see that. They really should close their curtains. Okay, here we go. Command support team, we've got shots fired on sub level 2163. Looks like G block again. Respond with caution, over. Let's go. 8257 responding, shots fired. Support team on route, over. Good luck, team. You're gonna need it. No, they can handle it. But could you test yourself the struck sequence for me? I wanna make sure it works. All right, take it easy. One of these days, that's gonna work. We're going down and checking it out. Let's go. Not down there again. What blaster fire? I didn't see anything. We have to rely on each other because we really can't trust anyone else. When we started six months ago, our team was 20 strong. Since then, I've been field promoted twice. We lost a lot of good people. Sure is, 185. Come on, let's get back to work. Why don't they mention these places in the recruitment pamphlets? Watch your spacing. 834, cover the corridor. Yes, ma'am. 117, check it out. Yes, ma'am. Looks clear. All clear. Let's go. No, come on. It's our last day. Will you two shut up? This sucks. Let's go. What's a couple of stairs? <sighs> I hate stairs. Huh? What level are we on? Uh, sub-level 17. When we hit 21, let me know. I'm gonna puke. <sighs> Just make sure you take off your helmet this time. Spread out. Yes, ma'am. Search team, support by fire. I'm not doing anything on this one. All right, enough with us. Ah! I think the stench down here is fogging up my goggles. Watch your footing. Oh, God. What did I just step in? I can actually see the stink. I hate this place. Isn't this the long way getting there? I want a full sweep. Split up. Ma'am, two with you. 834, you're with me. Yes, ma'am. Uh, is, is splitting up really the best thing to do? I hate splitting up. Good luck, guys. Mm, watch your six. Move in. All clear. Continue the sweep. We're too short of numbers for this. Did anyone else hear that? Negative. Just keep moving. I mean, really, I keep hearing something. What are you worried about? You got the big gun. Look what I got. There. Hear it? Uh, I'm serious. Will you quit it? Pick it up. There's nothing down here. Yes, ma'am. There. There was again. I'm hearing something, too. It's me saying I hate you. 
Ugh, I forgot how much this place stinks. Hold up, we've got a contact. Just one cover my left. Ready. Go. Don't move! Freeze, scumbag! Yeah, don't move. What are you doing down here? All clear. Don't worry, someone called it in and we're here to resolve it. Now clear out. Go on, get lost! Let's keep it moving. I think we're close. Yes, ma'am. Regroup! I want team on my six now. We've got flash fire at the end of G Block Hall 74 Alpha. I want to nail these guys before they move again. Did you hear that flash fire? It's been everywhere else in this place. Yeah, it's been found them. And it's about time. I've been waiting to get killed all day. Probably nothing. Oh, crap! Oh, 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 oh. Get back! All right, you guys. It's time to your combat pay. It's not that much. Hey, you guys have been asking for it. You two up front. Us? Oh. Move in and check it out. Gee, all this is a paycheck, too. Move it. Oh, we always go in first. They couldn't shut up, now they're quiet. I think they might need some backup. What do you think? Hold up. Room secured, but get in here, now. Let's go! Three friendlies pulling up the rear. 4-2, cover left. Yes, ma'am. 117, take center. I'm on it. Move! Don't even think about it. Hold it right there. I'm the reason you should have stayed at home. Take this and watch my back. You gotta keep an eye on these guys. Got it. Look, until we figure out what's going on here, as long as your mouth is moving, you're lying. Whoa, whoa. Ease up on this one. Let me check his injuries. Careful. These guys are sneaky bastards. It's all right. I'm a medic. Oh, what a mess. All right, what's the sit rep? Two are down, but not as a result of us. It appears that three parties are involved. A possible illegal poaching in progress while the third party maintains that we're interfering with a legitimate attempt to collect on a posted bounty. Why is your arm being... So far, all I'm getting is excuses, but it looks like things were about to get messy when we arrived. There's one injury, one fatality, and the big one won't shut up! Yeah, I see what you mean. And check this out. Trophies. These belong to him? He says they're someone else's. There he is. What, what can I hit armor like that? What is this? This is way under regulation. This is really cool. Is this a face that cares? I don't want to hear about that. Let's see your hunting license and registration item. Hey, easy big guy. You're not fire. Are you trying to piss me off or get your ass beat? Because you're two seconds away from both. Stop making excuses and give me some straight answers before I decide to take your weapons and leave you down here. Then we'll see how long you last. You ought to be ashamed of yourself taking something this small. Yeah, I bet it gave you a real fight. What's the extent of his injuries? Do we need a medevac? Negative. He'll be alright. Ah, oh, what a shame. Guys, I think this thing's still alive. You should be. Just move. No, it do. Ah, can't do anything for themselves. Maybe if they had some real on them. So let's get out. Don't shoot it. 52278, roger that. Yeah, this is your lucky day, Slim. Here's your frisbee back. Don't hurt yourself with it. Pack it up, we're moving out. You heard the word, pack up. 826, cover our out. Yes, ma'am. Nobody moves until we're gone. Let them sort this out on their own. Yeah, I'm watching you. Nobody better move. Recon 922, command dispatch. Please advise status on backup for code 3. Command 922, copy that. Be advised, support team 8257 is en route. Say again. Confirm support team en route. Command 922, that's Copy that. I really didn't want to call these guys in. Might as well have called in an airstrike. Yeah, you know how it's gonna go. Stop that shit. Blast them. <laughs> Why do we always gotta bail these guys out? Copy that. Because scout recon's been compromised. Again. Do they know we can hear them? Let's go. The scout team, what's your position? We're right in front of you, sir. I can see that. Now. What's the situation? Aren't you a little short for... Finish that sentence and die. What's the situation? We're checking out a possible lead on weapon smugglers. Yeah. Weapons, huh? Are you sure? We were about to override the lock. Door's locked? They're hiding something. We'll take it from here. Uh, I, I could try to bypass the security lock. Ugh, look. You bypass the lock or we'll bypass it. Either way, that door opens. We just came out of the worst yeah. sinkhole after facing off against some of the biggest, uh -huh. meanest, and yep. except for you, the ugliest thing this city has to offer. Yep. And I'm 
and determine the details of a situation, make the Empire's elite revered and respected. As the group drops out of hyperspace, the ships are ordered to maneuver defensively around the perimeter to ensure maximum coverage of the planet's surface. Following up on leads of illegal activity, the relentless Enter Battle Group exercise caution when approaching this remote system. In these situations, careful coordination between man and machine is imperative to the successful completion of a mission. Attention all flight now. Transport cargo loaded. Stand clear. Once orbit has been secured, the Relentless deploys the Cold Climate Assault Trooper Division to the surface of this frigid planet. Transport 98182 Zulu, prepare to initiate transport for drop sequence. Transport 98182 Zulu, please stand by for final safety checklist. Transport 98182 Zulu, roger that, standing by. Yes, sir, absolutely. Captain, all medical supplies, checkout, and personnel accounted for. So with your authorization, we're ready. Thank you, officer. That's good news. Yes, sir. Thank you. Uh, all right. Excuse me, Captain. Yeah. I've checked this bird out from top to bottom. Crew is secured and the pre-flight list checks out. You're good to go. 
So with your permission? Good work, Tech Sergeant. You are really. Safe flight and Godspeed, sir. Hey, you take care of my ship, you hear? I don't want the loading ramp all busted up again. Hey, I'm talking to you. It's my ship now, so should you be leaving? Uh, I'm too old for this. I should tell him to stick a load. Flight Grand Transport Niner 818 Zulu has pre-flight checkout and is awaiting authorization to initiate drop sequence. Transport Niner 818 Zulu, roger that. Hangar Bay personnel of third your ship. You're authorized to initiate drop. Transport Niner 818 Zulu, roger that. All right, crew, let's do this clean. Retract loading ramp. Yes, sir, retracting ramp. All drop stations, report go, no go for drop. Armor 18, drop station secure. Green light. Armor 24, green light. Armor 11, we're secure. Green light. Armor 32, green light for drop. Affirmative. Captain, all drop stations secured. Cargo cross lock engaged. Manual pre launch cycle engaged. Captain. Flight Command standing by. Thank you. Flight Command, Transport 98818 Zulu confirms all drop stations secured. Transport 98818 Zulu, roger that. Transferring vector heading for approach. Disengaging primary docking collar. You are clear for launch and the ship is yours. Drop them easy and hit them hard. 98818 Zulu, confirmed. Internals online, final pre-launch sequence, check. Confirm. Primary couplers released. Flight control systems online. Sealing all outboard hatches. Internal compartments pressurized. All integrity check. Receiving flight command to comms. Now I'm on the profile. Check. Coach vector locked into LZ. Check. Stand by to release. All stations get ready for a draft. We're opening the window. On my mark. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, Five, four, hey, three, what? two, Come on, that joke's getting old. one. Put that away. Mark. Disengaged. Deploying ramp. It's like the fifth one this month. LT, nice work. Every time. <laughs> Sir, comms, report mission status. Flight command, transport I, niner, A18 be Zulu, beginning insertion for patrol. Uh, if I lost that.
that thing again? Gator. Oh my god, quit messing around. Here, take it. Ah, about time. And quit moving my stuff. Some navigator. I don't even know how you found this job. <laughs> Please. When you're as good as me, the jobs find you. Speaking of jobs, we got about five minutes before the gears on the hydros freeze up and we're digging our way home. Right. The perimeter's clear for a 500 meter radius. There's no life sign. Are you sure? If there was anything exposed out there, I doubt we could inflict any more pain on them than what they're already going Talk through. Back to There's me. no metals, no munitions, no anything. <laughs> All right. Perimeter's clear, so let's secure it. Comms, get those straight legs off my ship. I want dust off in three minutes. Let's yes, not sir. take any chances here. Yes, sir. How about some numbers, Gator? Easy. Coordinates are as follows for armor 18, 24, 11, and 32, transferring to your console now. Got it. Attention all units. Stand by to receive vector headings for patrol. Armor 18, proceed on a 310. Armor 18, proceeding on a 310. Armor 24, on a 323. Armor 24, 323. Armor 11, proceed on a 562. Armor 11, acknowledge, moving out to 562. Armor 32, on a 510. Armor 32, proceeding on a 510. Raptors, secure the perimeter at 500 meters and scout vectors for your armors. Over. Roger that, Niner 818 Zulu. Raptor patrol moving out, securing perimeter at 500 meters. Captain, cargo has cleared the ramp. Very well, secure the ship. Roger, LT, hmm? prep for dust off. Yes, sir. Gator, you have the numbers. Roger. Uh, affirmative. These veteran assault troopers have developed skills in strategic combat operations when experiencing extreme terrain and weather conditions. Such training allows the Empire to easily deploy into areas that otherwise would be much too hazardous for other ground troops. Additional training and combat tactics, scouting and general support roles, allow them to be equipped with the latest in high technology weaponry. here, go ahead. Scout 3 in position. You looking for some coordinates? Roger that, Scout 3. We all arrived at grid It's about damn time. It's only 80 below. We've been out here a week. Rally point position is 41 decimal 40. Over. Yeah, I know. Shut up. I'm freezing too. Time to wrap it up and get the hell out of here. All troops to bond for recon patrol. Yes, sir. Tell the boys to gear up. We're moving out. Yes, sir. For this elite corps of assault troopers, fear is not an option. A lifetime of training has conditioned them to be alert and agile in the most undesirable of environments. All right, back there. Let's go for a clean dispersal this time. No promises. Doors up, ropes down, troops deploying now. To be a part of the special unit requires a high level of discipline and concentration, especially when working in tandem with the heavy mechanized armor of the support vehicles. <sighs> Talk about Ice Planet Zero. So, what's it look like? Looks like we're gonna be here a while. Although each trooper is also equipped with the appropriate survival gear, some small amount of tolerance must be observed for the extreme cold of the environment. Left side door, ramp is clear, troops are oh, down. Whoa, let's move it out. Squad one, down and clear. Squad two, bring up our six. Squad two, down and ready. On your six, roger. Oh, want a closer look? Let me give you a hand. Ah, quit scoring around. That's not <laughs> funny. <laughs> mm. Why do we always have to stay behind to do this shit? You're lucky this is a slow day, kid, otherwise we wouldn't be talking. I swear to God, these things are made out of ice. There have been times when I would have sent a couple thousand bolts downrange by now, and my spotter... That's you, FNG. Yeah, whatever. ...would be handing me a new barrel to change out. Yeah, I know, but for now, we have to... Uh, what's the manual say? It rhymes with maintenance. <laughs> oh, yeah. Constantly maintain and upkeep equipment in order to prevent malfunctions in the field. The machinery can easily be disabled by ice or freeze up completely. Like always. 
So a few of us, and by us, I mean me, <laughs> are assigned to remain on board to check over the hardware for signs of damage due to ice buildup. <laughs> That's right. And I act as a spotter for the gunners, when the situation demands. <laughs> yeah, right. That's not really why you're still up here. Oh, well, why? What then? Oh. Give me a break. You're not ready for the ground. The last time you went out, the squad had to carry all of your equipment. I mean, come on, kid. My armor's older than you are. Sure, whatever, Grandpa. That's enough, you guys. <clears throat> you know, when the cargo doors open, troops are deploying for a mission, things get real sticky up here. Especially on missions when we're deploying into hot combat zones. We are all there is to make sure the ground is clear for the troops and keep any hostiles off us while they're vulnerable. Yep, let me tell you, we know firsthand what it's like to rely on the guys in our position. We've put in our time on the ground already and have worked up to being stationed at this gun crew. Now it's our turn to see what we must have looked like when we were FNGs. <laughs> they're all scared spitless jumping out of a perfectly good armored box right into enemy fire. Believe me, it's no fun hanging out on that line in a combat zone for any amount of time. That's the truth. I heard that. Any number of things can go wrong in times like this. From our high vantage point, whether we're moving or standing, sometimes it's difficult to tell where the enemy fire is coming from and pinpoint targets, let alone hit anything. <clears throat> so generally, we laid down a wide field of suppressing fire in an attempt to cover the troops as they deploy. Now, these troops rely on us heavily for their safety when loading or unloading, so we take our jobs very seriously. Now, we've definitely got the best job on board. You think I'd want to be driving this thing? No thanks. Our only responsibility is to lay down cover fire for the ground troops. Period. Not driving or parking or even making repairs. Ugh, too much to worry about. For me, there is no other job. There's nothing like the sound or feeling of firing a gun like this, knowing you can't let up for a second without endangering the entire crew. This takes a special combination of quick reflexes, sharp eyes, and concentration. Maybe if you concentrated harder, you'd have as many hits as me. <laughs> Very funny. At least I only hit the enemy targets, you collateral bastard. <laughs> Now, there's always a risk of casualties on our missions. Our purpose and number one priority here is to minimize the risk for the troops and reduce their losses at a critical point in the engagement. If we manage to keep the enemy's heads down, then we did our jobs. If we do a good job on a mission, we get more of them back on board alive when it's over. If we don't, well, we want all of them to come back. But let's face it, they're not deploying for a picnic. Armor 18, ground patrol. We've reached the mark and we're breaking off. We'll rendezvous with you at 9 or 4-9-er. Do you copy? Copy that. Ground Patrol, good luck. We'll meet you at the rendezvous. Right side, door clear. Ground Patrol is clear. Come on, kid. Time for you to maintain and upkeep some hot coffee for me. Oh, man. Ready when you are. Clear the ramp. Troop door is coming down. Looks like a storm's coming in. Ha! Huh. Glad I'm not out there. How much time we got? Wanna get naked? God damn! <laughs> fly us and they drive us, and we're still walking to get there. Another day in the court. Uh, we got something, sir. What's on the box, 877? Could be a transmission. Signal's really faint. It's east, uh, west, it's that way. Where? About 750 meters north of our position. The, the code's not used by the Empire. Is that thing even working? Uh, yeah. All right, let's check it out. Uh, yes, sir. Wherever it is, it isn't friendly. The success of the Assault Trooper Division, combined with their fearsome reputation, has made the standard Assault Trooper a symbol of the new order. He's my ass off. In fact, the success rate for the thwarting lawbreakers is so high, most renegades would rather flee than engage them in confrontation. Scouts 8 and 7 are in position. They're tracking an unidentified inbound to our location. All right, troops, let's rally the dig in. You ready for this? I'm ready for anything. Visual contact acquired. Still no contact with primary target. Yeah, that figures. This job is 90% boredom, 10% terror. I hate these types. You know, I signed on with the Empire when I found out the terrorists had attacked the reserve base in my hometown. My friends and family were all killed in that battle. What? You never told me that. Yeah, the whole damn city was destroyed. That sucks. You know, I always used to think I was kept alive for a reason. 
Now I finally think I know what that reason is. Yeah, to kick some rebel ass. No, I'm not here for revenge. I'm here to make sure that what happened to me doesn't ever happen to anyone else. Huh. I remember my girlfriend graduated from the Imperial Academy as a fighter pilot. I had it bad for her. Must have been that uniform. Anyway, I enlisted with her. To be with her. Same thing. <laughs> yeah, can you believe it? As a pilot. What happened? I didn't make the cut and got transferred to the Snowtrooper Division. Big shocker. Could've been worse. Could've been transferred to the Scuba Troopers. <laughs> That's a great tune. Sure is catchy. Got him. Raider craft, 1500 meters and touching down. The damn goddamn time. Well, this is interesting. Lock and load, gents. These guys are no strangers. What do you mean? Just last month, it blasted its way out of Davenport Gateway. Son of a bitch. Well, that's not gonna happen this time. Crank it over! Fire it up! Sir! It won't turn over! Then fix it! Yes, sir. The girl? Huh? What happened with the girl? Uh, she dumped me and joined some rebellion. That sucks. Never fail. Oh, not again. Come on. Who's driving Stay that thing? goddamn on my ass. You think they heard that? Are you kidding? I can still hear that. Well, I, I don't know. Maybe they're... Whoa! They're on to us. All squads, open fire. Don't let that ship take off. Silvertail 63, evacuation code 519082. Are they serious? They can't be pulling us out. We just got here. It doesn't matter. All squads, continue covering fire and prepare to fall back to extraction point. We're leaving. It's gone. Better call it in. I'm not calling it in. You call it in. Yeah. Yeah, I'll call it in. Time to pop smoke and get the hell out of here. Looks like we got the smoke part covered. Cold Steel, Cold Steel, Silvertail 63, fire mission, over. Silvertail 63, Cold Steel, fire control. Go ahead with coordinates, over. Position 6219, fire for effect. Spotter will adjust, over. Roger, Silvertail 63, beginning orbit over target area. Stand by for support. The hammer's coming down, over. Roger that. Silvertail 63, ready for extraction, over. Squad 1, fall back. Fall back. Teamwork, precision, and confidence are key to success. Working together to solve any problem, both men and women are expertly trained to get the job done as guardians of order and justice throughout the galaxy.